as you see, I am back on this Madden 22 Ultimate Team. And I saw this Justin Fields running around a few games and I was wondering how in the world do I get this dude? So I was looking at these sets and I see here in the team builders, you only need like six cards in order to get this 84 overall. So I figured I'd go ahead and add these gold cards, tell these bad boys, bye bye. Bye bye. Cause you know I don't need them no more in order to get this hot diggity dog feels who did his thing in his debut preseason. So, hey, it's only right that I bring him over here on Ultimate Team and try to get it popping. Now I am adding those elites. Once we do that, we will get the pack and we will have to choose between Robert Quinn on defense or Justin Fields on offense. But I already done told you what I'm going for. We busted open this pack. Look at that, that thing right here. I'm loving the animation. We see that Fields, like I said, is an 84 overall Chicago Bears. We are 100% gonna bring him over to our team. Now you ain't even seen the attributes. 87 overall. Speed rating. The 88 throw power. Yo, this card is really looking like it is a steal with that speed alone. You know you'll be able to evade this pass rush. You'll be able to get away from the defense. So here is what my team is looking like so far. I still have a long way to go, and I really do need your guys' help on some of the cards you think I need to add to my offense, defense, all that good stuff. And... I am in need of some help <laughs> with some defensive schemes. I need something that will be able to stop these dudes out here on Ultimate Team, bro. These teams that I have been running against. <laughs> he got a legend up in his lineup. And my internet was tripping, so don't mind the skipping and the lagging, you know. It was my fault this time. I'll go ahead and admit it. I needed to reset my router anyway. I am in need of some help, like I said, getting these stops on defense. I can get down the field and score for the most part, but I don't know if it's the defense I'm running. I don't know if it's just the game. I can't stop this stuff over the top. And I put my defense in over the top and I still get burnt, you know? Now, I have to worry about this dude running these tight ends out of the backfield. Now, notice what his name is in the top right corner, <laughs> provolone, you know, like the cheese, right? So as soon as I saw that, I knew he was gonna come out here with some BS, but it's already fourth down. He is running the no huddle offense, trying to go for it. He got Justin Fields back there too, yeah. I already know he's dropping back. Plenty of time, gonna run for it, and he's getting the first down. Like I said, yeah, my internet was tripping a little bit. It's all good. I'll be back. I'll have that thing reset the next time I'm up here. Look at that boy, OJ Howard up the middle. Rumbling, bubbling, stumbling. Two tight ends running the ball. Look at this, bro. <laughs> hey, I missed the hit stick that time. That was my fault. I ain't going to lie. He is all the way down to the nine-yard line. I was like, how am I going to stop this run game? Now O.J. Howard come out and he got Ingram running this cheesy offense. I had no idea how I was going to stop this dude. Trying to get this touchdown on second and goal up the middle. He fumbled the ball and we scoop it up. But look, I am on the one yard line so I know I got to get rid of this quick. Over the middle to Kyle Pitts for the first down. We almost got the safety. Now with a second down, faking it. Look at that boy, Justin Fields. Rolling to the left, throwing it back the other way. Getting the first down now with a second down. Hold on. Beautiful block by my running back, Barkley. I'm throwing in D1. In the heck, when you look at that catch, this man really got both feet in bounds too. So just like that, I am back on defense. He trying to run that tight end again. Oh, 
out of the backfield in the pistol. I was not having it, bro. I was not. Oh, my gosh. Look at this. Look, we can't take him down either. He got the user truck running at no huddle with a second and three. Running that ball with OJ Howard. What if I told you that both of his tight ends had over 100 yards rushing? Would you believe me, bro? And what if I told you? Well, we'll see who wins. He's throwing it, getting the reception. And there go my internet tripping again. But now he's in the red zone once again. The first time, you know, he had the turnover. What will happen this time? We're stopping him, boy. Not allowing him to get to the outside. That is how we do it. But third down, running again, no saw. I already knew he was going to go for it on fourth down. Ended up calling a timeout is me because I want to switch up my defense and see if we can get this stop from the seven yard line. He needs four. Drop it back with Fields. Trying to run it and we suck it. That is what I am talking about. Once again, plenty of time all the way downfield. Kyle Pitts is a monster. He is pulling that one down now from the nine yard line. Pump faking, back of the end zone, we get it. Tell me you saw that pump fake by Justin Fields. This man is looking like a seasoned vet. And now with 15 seconds left, he's faking it to his running back. He's got to receive. Ooh. I didn't notice when I was actually playing, but I noticed that he had someone going deep. Running past the zone. Look at that boy. How am I supposed to stop that? Not even gonna lie, I was so upset when that happened. All I needed to do was get a couple stops before halftime. Instead, it's a 7 7 game just like that, but I am getting the ball, which is a good thing. So we definitely need to come out and get another score on this drive. Look at Barkley! Almost running it right up the gut, but instead we have a first down and 10. Here we go, keeping it on the ground. Barkley is taking off. Wait a minute, folks. Down the sideline. Woo! Juking back. Finally taken down after a huge gain. Now we have a first down and 10. Third quarter action. Look, I'm going to find my boy out of the backfield. Oh, my goodness. I stepped out of bounds. Would have had the first down. Instead, it's third and one. I'm dropping back. No, I was trying to pump fake. So, of course, I'm going for it on fourth and one. Probably pretty crazy, but I know I got somebody wide open. Going to find my homie, Barkley, to the left. And he is going to get that first down. Now we're sitting pretty in the red zone, making a few adjustments. Faking it to the running back. Plenty of time. To the end zone. Look at that catch, boy. Well, you kind of sort of saw the catch, but we knew that boy Kyle Pitts was going to come down with it. So just like that, we are going to take the lead 14 to 7. If only I could get a stop. Get the ball back. Try to milk some clock. Go down and get another touchdown. I figured we would be sitting pretty. Wait a minute. Look at Ingram. Wait, how is he out running a defensive back? What in the blood? Taking it all the way back. Tying the game up. Here I am in the same predicament. Right back on offense. Trying to go down. Hold on. Oh, no, 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 no. The lag hit me at the wrong time. 
And I'm all the way back to the three yard line with the sack. Dropping back. I got time. I'm rolling out. I wanted to pass it to wide, but oh my goodness, a fumble! Good thing he kicked it out of bounds. I am gonna punt this bad boy away. No, I am not gonna risk going for it way back on my own 11. Here he is on the punt return. Wait a minute, folks. Somebody better catch him, boy. He is still starting to drive from the 50-yard line, but that's better than the 11. Still running with the tight ends around the edge. Oh, gosh, yo. I had no idea how to stop this. Now with a second down, he literally should have just kept on running. Every time he tried to throw it aside from that long completion, we were pretty much getting sacks, you know. But now on third and 13, he's trying to throw it again. Wait a minute. Give me that. Finally making a play on defense. Now it is time, fourth quarter, clutch time, crunch time, whatever you want to call it. Look at that boy Pitts down the sideline, baby. All the way down to the 28 before getting tripped up. But we are sitting pretty now. We got plenty of time, all our timeouts. Justin Fields going to find somebody. Sam, you are hurtling into the end zone. up by seven now we got to try to play defense <laughs> easier said than done man going up against provolone cheese hold up he's rolling throwing it right back to yeah one of them tight ends look at him rumbling bumbling whatever to the 49 yard line we got to try to get a stop we need a fumble we need an interception. He's definitely trying to throw it deep. Wait! We can't take down Justin Fields! Please make this dude fumble the ball. One minute left in the game. Running it again with Howard! Breaking a tackle. Getting to the 28. He's got the drive going. He only used one timeout. Justin Fields dropped back. No, he's thinking about running with it. We got the defense right there. 13 seconds. Can we get a stop? Yes, we can. We have to do that a few more times, but it's from the one yard line. He's trying to punch it in and he does. Instead of going for the field goal, he is trying to go for the win. I'm like, dude, hold up, I need a second. Let me call a timeout and regroup my defense. We cannot let him get this. Fields dropping back. We're gonna get it, boy! In the backfield! So now he has to go for the onside kick. If he does not get this, we have the victory. I'm like, please, team. Do not let him recover this. We got it! Held on to the ball. Kneel down, and we're going to walk out of here with it. Daddy. But, yeah, get yourself this Justin Fields. He's pretty nice, man. Yeah, he got the speed, all that good stuff. And don't be cheesing like Provolone over here, though. And teach me how to play defense. Take me out of here, Siri! That's nasty. Peace.